with um, at least recent news, Michael Badgley released, um, and you know the 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 Lions picked up Riley Patterson. They had that the kicker from the XFL. Yeah. Uh, basically, have two kickers right now currently. Are you concerned? Uh, to me, I don't give a damn. Michael Badgley was always a placeholder. Uh, no pun intended. But I, I don't really care about this new Sam Flynn. I think the Lions are going to be fine. A lot of kickers are still available out there in the market. So. I mean, I, I suppose, but at the same time, as much as we want to, in, in a perfect world, kickers wouldn't mean as much as they do. But in the reality is, in close games, they can be the difference between winning and losing games. Games in which the best athletes in the world have fought their hearts out, and then a kicker can come in and shank a field goal, and they lose, a la, um, what was that guy's name? Blair Walsh in that playoff game at home against Seattle for the Vikings where he shanked like a 29-yard field goal. But that's... Made my heart very happy. Yeah, pff, man. Th those Seahawks teams could won games in some crazy ways. Yeah. But but that's a, that's a besides besides the point. Kickers play a bigger role than I think any of us even really want to comprehend. And the thing about Michael Badgley is I feel like he's a guy that maybe got a little bit over... I wouldn't say slandered, but people kind of thought he was a placeholder. I know some people like Neil Rule from Big D Energy was just caping up. We got to draft Jake Moody. We got to draft Jake Moody. <laughs> But the reality is, when you look at the numbers last year, what if I told you guys, I feel like I do this a lot, that Justin Tucker's field goal percentage was 86% and Michael Badgley's was 857 Justin Tucker, best kicker ever. Michael Badgley, cut bum. Well, my, my question would be, what was his longest kick, though, Badgley? I, I'm not saying he's better. I'm <laughs> okay. saying I, I do this to put a little bit of perspective into things. And when it comes to extra points, Michael Badgley was 100%. Justin Tucker was 96.9. So Michael Badgley, I think, was a little bit better than people would, would, would want to give credit for.